Hey guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I want to show you all the loot I got from Gamescom. There is so much stuff this year and let's dive right into it. So they mostly give away shirts and bags and all of that and I got plenty of those bags. So these were from the Omen booth and um, yeah and PUBG so I got plenty of them. Look at this. So <laughs> they gave them all to me because they didn't need them anymore and so I was, I was like okay give me all your bags so I never have to use plastic bags again <laughs> okay and then I had a press meeting with a Techland who are the developers of Dying Light and uh, everyone who watched the presentation got one of those cool backpacks I really like how they are looking the quality seems to be okay and in the backpack there is more stuff so so in the back there is a Dying Light belt you can't really see that I think but that is a very nice belt uh, that came with it and and then we have a I don't know what that is is it a scarf what is it is it a headband I don't know but it has dying light bad blood written on it so bad blood is it the DLC dying light is the new game and um, so <laughs> the funny thing is so uh, Gamescom was closing and they were all closing down their booths and I, I I just walked past them and there were like energy drinks in front of the booth and I asked them if they if I can take one so they had like red ball and they had um special dying light energy drinks and they gave me like I don't know six or seven of them I really like them and they didn't need them anymore and they gave them all to me and when they did that they said uh, or they asked if we still need bags because we obviously can't carry all those energy drinks like that so they gave us a plenty of those bags which are just very very simple ones that have a uh, dang light written on it and i got a couple of them as well so we have one two um and there is another one down here three so I have plenty of them. There are more in my room. Wait a minute. <laughs> there is... Right, I, I used this one during Gamescom, so there is already stuff in it. So these are very convenient if you want to go to uh, Gamescom or something like that, because they are easy to carry. But this bag, like the uh, first one I got, has much better quality. I really like how this is looking. They also made it a bit dirty just, you know, to, to, to make it look like, I don't know, you used it in the apocalypse or something and guys by the way if anybody plays quake so when i'm streaming quake next i have that many codes so if anybody wants the next champion um character uh in quake then make sure to watch my next stream because every single follower gets a key okay so at the dying light booth they had so many different types of bags and this is the last one which has like this part down here is see-through it's like fishnet or something like that and it has bad blood written on it so it's a bit different i like this one more than the other ones because this has some nice details to it but yeah i, I like them all so i love dying light and this is just the perfect bag for me <laughs> Okay, then I have a World War Three bag. Um, I don't remember where I got this, but I got it, and it's an, an, it's just another bag. You know, the thing is, I always carry these bags with me when. It, like every handbag or every backpack I have has one of those in it because sometimes you just go grocery shopping or you go somewhere and suddenly need a bag and I don't want to buy any I, I haven't bought a plastic bag in ages simply because they are so bad for the environment and that is why I carry these with me they are also made of plastic I think this doesn't really feel like fabric but these you can use these ones so so often so they are so much better for the environment you can reuse them make sure to get one of those as well so yesterday i went to the xbox stage i pretty much spent the whole day at the xbox booth and i got a nice xbox um yeah another backpack i don't know do these have a certain name because i honestly don't know if they do or 
what they are called but I got one from Xbox which is nice as well and then I got one from Twitch. Another Twitch bag. I, as you know I stream on Twitch and I think it's so cool having one of those Twitch bags. Okay and something very this isn't gaming related and this is also not sponsored but their Pringles had, had its own booth and they did like small challenges and um, you only had to like build the highest tower with um with uh, with pringles or you had to shoot them and try to make them fall down like stuff like that and each time you you play this you got free pringles and i got so much pringles here um there is even more pringles here so i have plenty i don't have to buy pringles ever again as we are already talking about food i so in the business area you can get so much free food which is great because games come as expensive and i don't want to waste any money so from the UK booth I got like candy floss popcorn and I have so much and when I went to um, like there is even more popcorn you can't really see it but I have so much popcorn here and um, I see like EA has its own business area like its own business hall and they had so many of those okay these are crisps and they are called corna cornados cornados i don't know they are so good oh my gosh i love them so much like they are new in the market i think i've never seen them in the supermarket before but i will buy them constantly from now on because these are so oh my gosh I, I just want to eat one now <laughs> okay and i put this just in a small bag that i also got at gamescom it says 100 percent organic downloads Oh, and uh, there is more di um, dying light stuff here. I don't know what that is. Do I have to attach this to the backpack or what the hell is this? I don't understand. <laughs> Okay, I'm currently hosting a giveaway on um, on Twitter and I got so many freaking Xbox Game Passes. So if you want to participate, then make sure to um, follow me on Twitter, retweet the tweet and make sure to follow me on either Twitch or YouTube and then you can win one of those. Yay! <laughs> And I also have um, like these stickers, they, they are from DayZ and they are for the Xbox controller. I don't have one of those, so I, I only have a PS4 controller. So if anybody's interested, let me know because I can't use it. Okay, and now I have like small keychains and all of that. So I went to Bethesda, I got this awesome Pip-Boy. A mask which I love because as you know I love Fallout and this is just perfect and then I got this little keychain and he's on this one as well it's from Fallout 4 and then I got this cap from Vault 76 this is so cool I love this as well and honestly I got so many buttons yesterday like I have one from Ori I have another one from Ori I have so many Ori pins guys and I have one from uh, Tomb Raider I have a necklace from Metro Exodus. I also have a necklace from Battlefield, but I don't know where it is right now. I will show it to you later. Then I have uh, Xbox pins. I have a couple of those. And I have a Xbox Game Pass pin. And I have plenty of alpha keys for Breach. I don't know what kind of game this is, but if anybody wants an alpha co uh, code, just send me a message because I have so many, look at this. Like I have all these codes and I don't know what to do with them. They just gave them to me and I was like, what, what am I supposed to do with this? So if anybody wants something, just write a comment down below Okay, I got something else. So uh, this is from PUBG. And let me see what we have inside. I don't even remember, to be honest. Uh, okay, so these are another two two necklaces. Let's see if we you can see that. The, this says Gamescom 2018. And it has a, a PUBG on the other side. And this one says winner winner chicken dinner okay stickers that i have from all the bethesda games and i think it's time to move on to shirts okay i don't know if these are all shirts that i got because my room is a freaking mess and i'm, I'm just going to show you the ones that are right next to me so 
first of all i got a dying light shirt of course um as i said i went to the press meeting for dying light too and they uh, like in each bag there was a dying light shirt um then i went to um life is strange too and oh my gosh i cried there that was so terrible like the game is great but i was shook <laughs> okay so i got a uh, Life is Strange 2 shirt. It's basically only a forest and two people walking down there and it says Life is Strange on the back. And then okay so yesterday I was um, in front of I was like um, in front of the Xbox station they were throwing shirts and backpacks and I kind of got into a fight so there were four people who were trying to beat me up for a freaking Xbox um, backpack. And, um, like, everyone was so tall there and I wasn't able to catch anything. And I was standing right behind a guy who was, like, really tall. And he gave me two shirts, which was so kind. Like, I don't know why he did it, but if you are watching this, thank you. So, um, it's a Mixer shirt. I have to I have to wear this when I stream next time because I always stream on Mixer as well. And it says Realm Royale on the back. Um, I really enjoyed this game, but never played it much. So, it's a good... Um, the Battle Royale game and it's different compared to a PUBG and Fortnite because it's all about magic and stuff like that so I have two of those shirts I really like them they are a bit too big for me but who cares I always wear over the sized shirts okay then yesterday I went to the Ezo Tavern which is like an event that Bethesda does every year for the Elder Scrolls Online so they meet up basically and you can have uh, drinks and food there and it says ESO uh, Tavern Cologne 2018 um, and it has this on it and this is honestly the best ESO shirt I've ever gotten like usually it just has the ESO symbol on it or like the Morrowind symbol last year but this for, for, um, for the Wolf Hunter DLC looks sickening I love this shirt I wish I had more than this one but yeah, I really like it. Um, the next one is another... I have so much Dying Light stuff. Please, this isn't sponsored, okay? Um, this is uh, from Dying Light Bad Blood. It's the Battle Royale DLC. Um, a video on this will come probably tomorrow or the day after. I don't really know yet. But this is this was really cool as well. Um, then we have a Darksiders shirt. So at Gamescom I played Darksiders for the first time in my life and this is such a cool game. I really enjoyed it. I think I should play the other games as well. Um, okay, then I have some more Dying Light shirts. I think some of them are also from my sister. So um, <laughs> um, And the last shirt I got is from Rage 2. Rage is such a cool game but I had fun playing it but it's not really my kind of game. I also didn't play Mad Max because the game is great, but it's it's not my cup of tea, okay? Um, okay, so these are, I think, all the shirts and all the bags I got. I still have, like, small pins, but I don't think it's interesting to show you every single pin I got. And I have, like, small necklaces or um, bracelets, stuff like that, but I don't think that's really interesting. So what is really interesting is the cyberpunk statue I got. Okay, so this is... So this is the cyberpunk statue I got. It looks absolutely amazing. Only press got this and you had to watch the one hour presentation of cyberpunk for this. A video on this will come shortly. I'm still working on all the reviews and all of that. So please be patient. It will come very soon. But let me show you a close look of this. Okay, so this is the statue. It looks absolutely beautiful. Um, I don't want to put her out of the plastic so I will put put her inside again because I don't want to ruin it like the detail is just incredible this is as good as the witcher statue from the collector's edition so this looks just this looks an amazing I mean look at the detail look at everything this is so freaking beautiful and this is what I'm most proud of honestly um, I'm super excited about the game, so if you want to watch the um, review, then make sure to do that once it's up. That will come very soon within the next few days. And thank you guys for watching my haul video. This was the first time I have ever done a haul, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions about Gamescom or 
yeah, if you just want to ask something, do that down below in the comments. I always reply to all comments. So if you have any questions, then make sure to write them down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to check out my new videos as well. I uploaded a Witcher Q&A the other day. Um, and in this Q&A, they answer, or the developers answer questions like, what happened to your, your with? Or they answer the question about Siri being in Cyberpunk. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. And we will see each other in the next one. Bye, guys.